right guys welcome back to ironclad rc got the ul19 out here at the park pond all right uh this is a fresh built boat all carbon fiber okay i got the srd 8150 c packs in this boat tp power 4060 1900 kv just a v1 motor hydra xlx2 with the mad lizard turn fin curved turn fin we're at the park we're going to do some ovals here and i've got uh, Oxteen 4519 on this boat. That prop is boss on this boat. I'm not even kidding, boys. So stick around, you guys. We're going to have some fun. Uh, I think I got another set of packs for the boat, too. I just got done running the drag boat in the Velez. So um, it's about to get dark. Sorry about the light. So stick around. Big B. What are you, Clad RC? All right, let's get the remote switched over. To the UL. Three boats, one remote. DX5 rugged, man. Link in the description. Freaking awesome remote, you guys. I'm telling you, if you have more than one model, it holds 25, I believe. Man, it's good. It's a good remote. I've had it for a year now. I absolutely love it. Okay, so I was running the Oxteen 2200 in this boat, and I am going to put that motor back in, but I've got to get the firmware. Uh, downloaded onto my Hydra so I can change some parameters in there. Until then, we're going to be running the TP motor, okay? Whoa, that motor's got some oomph. I can't do no speed run. Got the guy over there fishing. Turn fins want to pick the front of the boat up. All right. So it's wanting to pick the front of the boat up here, okay? So it's got some, it's got some angle like this. Then, if it's wanting to pick the boat up, your turn fin's angle like that. You need to actually cant it down a little bit. Oh, geez, that thing's sharp. I just cut my hand up. All right, let's see if that does it. Yeah, here we go. There we go. Now she'll hook. Look at that turtle right there. Now she'll hook. That's that 4060 boy. Now she'll hook. Yes, sir, buddy. Yes, sir. It's crazy what a curved turn fin will do on a boat. Coming in hot. <laughs> All right, let's check the temps. That was uh, several laps there. Let's let's check the temps out here. New motor. Well, it's an old motor. This motor is at literally. This motor is literally, literally three years old. Okay, I've had this motor in several, several boats. Several boats. My Delta Force. I've had it in all my boats, basically. Except for the VLS. All right, so 49. Just beating around there because jerk off over there wants to fish right in my way. He was on the other side of the pond. I'm going to have to put some tape on this thing. Trust me, baby. It's not the tape. Trust me. Let's check the temp here. 100 degrees on the motor. Oh, that's what it was. The freaking water jacket. <laughs> no wonder I had a bunch of water in my boat. The water jacket was pushed past the end of my motor motor end bell. <laughs> no wonder the freaking boat was full of water. Oh, that looks good though, man. 90, 98 degrees. That's freaking awesome. Yep. All right. <laughs> Yes, sir. She'll turn with that freaking rudder, uh, turn fin on. Just as hard as she'll go, boy. Holding down, too. Yep, 
And that 4519 is boss on this boat. Full trigger, full trigger, full trigger. Three quarter, three quarter, half, three quarter. Full. Full, 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 full. Get it, bull. Yes, sir. That's how a hydro plane is supposed to run right there. All right, let's bring her in. That's probably my battery. All right. That's how she's supposed to run right there, boys. Yes, sir, buddy. Big difference between a short turn fin and a curved turn fin. Yes, sir, buddy. All right, so let's throw let's throw these 6500s in. All right, these are brand new. Brand new 6500 HCL HPs. Last time I had those batteries out, I flipped my 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 sonic wake v2 and destroyed my hatch destroyed it tore it all to hell let's check the let's check the temp real quick after that hard run let's check the temp after that hard run 102 on the motor okay 93 xlx2 84 not even breaking a sweat come on <laughs> 103 yes sir buddy all right so i use this jam foam on top of my batteries here okay now there's just a little bit of water in the boat not like it was okay like like before i had the, like i said that freaking cooling jacket was pushed all the way back qs8s are like like cold lukewarm if that all right this is the 8000 8000 srds let's check capacity Oh, 8,000 SRDs, 382, 382. So I pulled them out just on the right time, 382, 382. Yes, sir, buddy. All right, so let's put these 6,500s in there. Come on, come on, all right. Might need to get a bigger jam foam for these. They're a little bit smaller than the 8,000s there. So I usually bring a few different foams with me so I can shim up my batteries so that they don't go flying on me. All right. Get her plugged in here. CG's a little bit too far back. Yes, sir. Let me get you guys zoomed in. Hopefully, hopefully everything's in the screen. She is fast. Yeah, I think my next motor is going to be a 4070 C CM motor. Woo, about lost her, boy. Yeah, my CG's a little bit too far back. She's wanting to pick up on acceleration. It's a shame they don't make this boat anymore, man. If you guys run across this boat on, on Facebook or uh, eBay, I would, I would jump on it, man. I want to get another one. I want to get another, like a blank hull. Okay, I want to get another blank hull, and I want to put twins in it. That's what I was. That's what I was going to do with this build right here. I was going to put twins in this boat. Twin 3650s. The dynamite six pole 19 or 2000 twin i want to do it so bad i can't stand it oh whoa, whoa. dancing baby dancing that blueprint's holding up good on the boat full trigger in a turn full trigger another pretty hydroplane is the uh the, the TFL Popeye, that's a pretty one. Now, if you guys are looking for an all-out catamaran, check out Oxstein's Animal Twin. 
And uh, man, I, I want to say that I want to say he has a mini animal twin coming out. You know, if I'm not mistaken, I seen a little short that he made last year of a mini, a micro twin cat. But that freaking scorpion rigger he's got, that all carbon fiber scorpion rigger that Oxine has, that thing is boss, boy. That thing looks boss. Yes, sir, buddy. Whoa, 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 woo! About had a heart attack. Should move that CG back, but I don't feel like I'm in the groove, boy. Get it, boy, get it, boy. Look at that sheet of damn spray coming off of her, son. Endless grunt with that speed control there. I'm getting another one. I was gonna get a UDI arrow or, or a little cheap ready to run boat, but I don't think I am. I think I'm gonna get a freaking XLX2, y'all. I was gonna get the little UDI arrow with like an upgrade motor, you know? But I think I think you're gonna get a freaking XLX2, man. For the 42, it's driving me nuts. To be more careful, boy. Full trigger. Man, them 6500s is where it's at, y'all. They're on sale right now. Check them out at SMC. Got to be more careful, boy. All right, I'm bringing her in. That's the that's the hardest I've ever ever. That's the hardest I've ever run this boat, ever, without any power cuts, without any kind of interruptions. That right there is the hardest I've ever run this boat straight in an in oval, ever. Sir, buddy, son. 105, 129, 131, 96, 81 on the ESC, 81. The wires are 94. 123 on the main wires. Battery ESC wire, 100. QS8s is 100. Okay, the motor, 93. So let's check uh, capacity on the batteries. These are new batteries. Second time I've ever been out. I just run the snot out of them. Woo, they're discharged. I'm glad I brought it back. Three, four, five. Holy cow. That's the worst thing in the world for a battery, you guys, to discharge it past 342, 340. Okay, that's terrible. So I need to go home and put these on storage right away. That is the worst thing for a battery. All right. So, uh, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, the boats ran good. The boats freaking ran phenomenal, you guys. This one run exceptionally well. I'm super pleased with this boat, okay? The drag boat, we tried the, the inward rotating propellers. That boat ran good, okay? It was really hard to see a performance gain or performance sag uh, with the inward versus outward. And the Velez, freshly blueprinted boat. I was out here just kind of beating around, testing it out before I go to the speed run spot. So we'll see you guys next time. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Balls to the wall, oval action, son. Wide open throttle.